hello everyone welcome back to another tutorial in this video we are going to learn how you can schedule a zoom meeting for that all you have to do go to your website uh, zoom website and click on my account if you're logged in if you're not logged in please make sure to you are sign in and click on my account and in here you see an option called schedule a meeting click on this option now in here in scheduling a meeting you are going to give a title to your meeting in here write the description of the meeting and in, in here write the day uh, you know day uh, the the time uh, at which you want the meeting to start and write the duration of the meeting for the basic plan you know you would be only able to make a 40 uh, minute meeting that means zero hours and 40 minutes because that's a uh, free uh, free you know uh, f for free but if you want to upgrade that plan you can uh, upgrade that plan as well all right let me write it down all right okay you can make it 40 all right and that way you're gonna uh, choose this one and this way you will be choosing the time zone which time zone you want and if you want to make it a recurring meeting uh, by which i mean like you want this meeting to uh, occur every uh, every week or every you know every second day third day you can select it by this one because after every you know for schools and colleges for teachers this option is good uh, this reminds other students to participate on the particular date so this is for recurring meetings and in here you will be getting this uh, generated automatically but i'll suggest you to go on click uh, personal meeting and in here you will be giving students your uh, personal meeting uh, id you want to send this one and give them this password so whenever they log in uh, with they will be logging in with this id and they will be logging uh, putting this password i'll tell you where they are going to put it and when did they put it uh, automatically they will be joining your uh, you know a lecture when uh, whatever at whatever time you are going to be live and you can also uh, enable these options you can enable uh, join before host like if you are uh, not uh, you know available not start a meeting but people can see uh, people can open it up uh, so that's a good option i'll go for it uh, mute participants upon entry that's a great option do it as well ticket uh, because when participants uh, enter the, there is a lot of noise of microphone nobody notices it so it's better better to let them be uh, quiet for some time for about five minutes then automatically their voice will be you know okay and in here you can click an option called save and that way you're going to uh, uh, start this meeting you know you you got the id you got the password and you're going to just send them and at that particular date you have actually scheduled a meeting now in here you can see the meeting id uh, this is the meeting id you're going to send this one to your students and your password in here that you can you can either show it or not if you want it and in here all the details of the meeting you can even edit your meeting down here you can see an option called delete delete this meeting you can even delete this meeting you can edit this meeting and you can even start this meeting at the very present moment so whatever you want you can do it uh, with just a click of a button and let me tell you how where you're gonna put if you are a student where you're gonna put the password so for example if you have created a schedule meeting and you want to send it to your students uh, give them the link so what you're gonna do is uh, click on this button called join click on it and when you click on join meeting you will be as you have seen already i have uh, told you that there was a meeting id you just gonna give them that meeting id when they're going to put it here and whenever they're going to put the meeting id and just they click on join automatically they are going to be in your uh, scheduled meeting so that's it regarding how you can schedule a meeting and how you can even attend a scheduled meeting so if you think this video helped you please make sure to leave us a comment and keep visiting tiger schooling